Jordan Reindoller, 20 years old. Um, I basically was uh, sleeping inside my house, and I and I uh, woke up to a bunch of pounding at my house, and then I heard my neighbors yelling. And what happened was is that the house caught on fire, and it was maybe roughly uh, 15 feet tall. I came outside with my garden hose, and I started shooting down the house. And I, even though that you know didn't work, but I think it you know counted for something. And then. Um, the firefighters came and told me that I was doing enough, but I was just trying to help anyway. Um, I was helping my, uh, my Uncle Glenn down the street and make sure that he was doing okay. And then more firefighters came and then they started shooting shooting down the house. And um, basically more people came, more more policemen came, and they're all trying to you know do everything down here and do uh, traffic and stuff like that. But I tried to break down the fence over here and that didn't work. But the firefighters got it down all over here, and um, they were trying to save the dogs over here too. And I was trying to save a couple too, but it didn't work. Uh, I, I ended up uh, later on saving one of the dogs. I ended up running back inside, you know, like all of this stuff. And um, the dog had bloody feet and all that, but it's the, uh, I think the dog's taken care of now. And what happened was is that the, I guess the fire broke out. The two people were inside the house. They ended up coming out. One of them was inside the ambulance. The, the other was uh, was across the street, being treated by, uh, by, by uh, one of my friends. And and then more people came down and just trying to ask what happened. But other than that, uh, more firefighters came down and shot down the house. I was trying to save my animals too in case the fire broke out onto my house as well. But. Uh, one of the people that came out of the house, he ended up having a, he ended up having a burn on, um, on his right arm. I think it was his right arm. And uh, then, and then the other one, uh, Uncle Glenn, he had stage four cancer, so he wasn't doing so good uh, trying to treat the fire. And uh, he ended up passing out a few points, but the ambulance kind of hurt him out. And we ended up trying to catch him before he fell. But I think they both went went to the hospital, and then me and my friends were um, asked to go to the hospital as, as well to treat the um, smoke inhalation. Yeah. And other than that, that's about it.